Hello and welcome to Chagas Consultant College, providing education and training in agriculture, horticulture and equine studies. My name is Tim Ashmore and I'm going to bring in a short tour of the campus and the, and the farm enterprises. Our tour begins here in the main education building, which includes computer rooms, laboratories, lecture theatres and the main student area. Condalton College works closely with Waterford Institute of Technology in the delivery of Level 7 and Level 8 programmes in Agriculture, Horticulture, Forestry and Food Science. Chagas also works in conjunction with University College Dublin in the delivery of the Advanced Diploma in Dairy Farm Management and the Bachelor of Science in Dairy Production. Kildalton has an interesting history. The main house was built in 1755 as part of the Besborough estate owned by the Ponsonby family. In 1941, the Oblate Fathers purchased the house and farm as a training centre. In 1971, it was sold to the Department of Agriculture and was opened as Kildalton Agriculture and Horticultural College. Residential accommodation is available in Kildalton for over 80 students in single study bedrooms. The accommodation is offered to the first year students attending full-time courses in Kildalton. The Kildalton College Farm plays a key part in student training and skills development. It consists of 167 hectares of mixed dairy, tillage and dry stock enterprises. The dairy herd consists of 100 spring calving Frisian and Jersey cross cows. The herd allows students experience a low input grass based milk production system. A new milking parlour was built in 2009. The Advanced Certificate in Dairy Herd Management students manage their own herd at the College as part of this course. The Condalton Suckler Herd is made up of 60 Continental Cross Suckler cows plus replacements. All progeny are reared to beef. The aim is to maximise lightweight gain from grass and minimise winter feed costs. Bulls are finished at under 16 months, heifers are between 18 and 20 months and steers are 24 months old. The best male calves from the dairy unit are finished in the dairy calf to beef system. The sheep flock consists of 180 yews which are lambed in two blocks to facilitate student learning. 100 yews lamb in early January and the remaining 80 in February. All lambs are finished off grass in a mixed grazing with the suckler herd. There are approximately 60 horses at the college for use by the equine students. These consist of riding horses, brood mares and young stock. The students are given responsibility for the training and upkeep of these horses. Equine students can choose to study either equitation or stud management. A wide range of arable crops are grown in Cadolson as part of variety evaluation trials, crop input trials and the student crop demonstration area which is used for skills training. The students of the Advanced Certificate in Machinery and Crops Management course are actively involved in the establishment and management of these crops. The tillage crops grown in Kildalton include wheat, barley, oats, oilseed rape, peas, beans, maize and bioenergy crops. Kildalton College has a large fleet of modern machinery equipment and workshops. At the college we strive to teach students with the most up-to-date equipment and techniques. Students in Kildalton get practical experience calibrating, operating and repairing a wide range of machines including boom sprayers, corn drills and fertiliser applicators. The horticultural unit in Kildalton has a wide range of enterprises including fruit and vegetables, amenity, nursery, protected crops and sports turf. Kildalton College is one of the oldest orchards in Ireland with an extensive range of varieties. Produce from the horticultural enterprise is sold in the college farm shop. We run two open days in the college, one in March and one in October, which will give you the opportunity to visit the campus and enterprises and talk to the college staff. For further information, please visit the Chagas website www.chagas.ie, the Chagas Kildalton Facebook page, or contact us directly on 051 6 4 0, 0.